All right, we're back with the guns only playthrough. And as you can see, the map is looking pretty green, lads. It is looking pretty green. We finished off last time by taking out the last of the Empire, the North and the South. The Empire is no more. This now means there is just one kingdom that stands in our way of a united Calradia. And it is the Asarai. At the moment, we're not at war with them. So I think the plan is, is quickly do a recruitment run. Just to bulk up my men a little bit. We don't need a lot of men. But uh, we're just missing a few. And then I think I'll march on, uh, march on into the desert, lads. Maybe raid a village, start a war and, well, kill some lords. You know the drill. Alright, we have made it to the desert and the army is assembled. We're ready, lads. We are ready. If we take a look at the kingdoms, we can see the Asari. They have two mercenary clans. So we're going to have to watch out for them because they're probably at full strength, to be honest with you, if they've just been chilling for a bit. But this is the clan that we need to kill. There are three targets in this clan. I think what I'll do is I'll walk deep into Asari land. I think I'll find a village to raid to start a war and then maybe siege a castle. Maybe we can bait enough of the lords to just attack me in one go that we have one big decisive fight. And then that fight basically just ends the war. We take them all out that is anyway. Alright lads this is it. We are going for it. We're going to raid the village. The war has begun. <laughs> Well, the plan has sort of worked. We have dragged a few lords out into a fight. But three of them are mercenaries, which isn't great. But we do have at least one of the people we need to kill. So, uh, well, I know we're outnumbered, lads. But uh, let's just give them a jolly good thrashing, eh? Alright, the terrain isn't the greatest. But it is just a funnel, which means we can't really get flanked. So that's a good thing, I guess. Oh, the lads are assembling the box already. Alright, men, just hold them back. This is the ranged troops. But that's not the problem here, lads. The ranged troops are not the issue. We should be firing on the, uh, the 200 infantry that are marching right at us. Lads. Lads, ignore the 10 horses over there. And shoot the 200 infantry that's marching right at it. <laughs> oh god, now there's cavalry coming in. Now there's cavalry. Oh god, we're just up on this rock watching it all go down. Alright, come on, men. Just hold the line, lads. Hold the line. This is actually fine, men. This is fine. Alright, we got a bit of cav that's breached the lines of wheat. That is fine. Not a problem. Seems that the enemy are pretty much in full retreat. There's one or two that are that are trying to well, get back up, buddy. Well, that's that done, lads. Desert battles are great. <laughs> All right, so that is one of three lords down, lads. Maybe we keep sieging the castle to see if we can bait out the other ones. Okay, we got three mercs come in. Ah, oh, man, we've attracted the wrong crowd again. You guys aren't what we're looking for. I don't care about mercs. Well, lads, we're back in the same terrain. Time to rinse and repeat, eh? Alright, the ranged cavalry is about to enter range. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, they're pretty much done for. They're pretty much done for. 
Look at that guy go. Oh, he's gone all right. Unlike the last fight, these guys, uh, there's no uh, shield wall or anything like that. It's every man for himself and they're just running as fast as they can. <laughs> Oh no, cavalry coming over the hills. That's always fun. That's it lads, huddle together in one big group. That's it, just huddle together. Alright, that is another decisive victory for the resistance, lads. It's just a bit of a shame that they were all mercenaries again. And there's another mercenary here. Oh, hold up. Alright, you're one of the people we're hunting. Okay, we know where one of you are. Now, where's the other one? Is the other one going to show up and can we kill you both? Oh, he's running away. Why are you running away? Alright, we're going to have to chase him, lads. Scrap the siege. We need this guy dead. He's gone inside this city. Oh, no. I guess we're sieging this city now. Hang on a minute. This is great, lads. We were sieging this castle because one of the lords ran inside and is hiding. And while we were sieging it, we just got attacked by some mercs along with the leader of the Aserai. So if we win this fight and kill this guy, then we just win the siege and kill that guy and it's all over. Oh, we're not in our little canyon way this time, lads. We're in an open desert. Oh, God. Is this going to play to our advantage? Or is this actually going to uh, cause our downfall? Either way, we need to win this fight and we can't afford to take too many casualties. Alright, that's one of the leaders running straight at us, isn't it? Let's let's get rid of this guy, shall we? There we go. Now the men will blow up all the ranged. Alright, the ranged are pretty much all dead. Get out your box, lads. Reform the line. And get ready for the infantry that is running at us at full speed. Oh, God. Look at them, man. Look at them. We need to blow up enough of them that they back off and think we should actually form a shield wall. They're not backing off. They're not backing off, lads. Half the lads aren't even shooting. They formed such a tight box they can't see. That's it, men. Keep up the fire. Keep up the fire. All right. That kill feed is going to look a little red soon. The kill feed is going to be looking a little red. Not too bad, though. We have lost a few men. Oh, shit. Ah, that's what you get for running through an army of rifles, lads. You get shot. Right, I think the line needed to be spread a bit wider. We had a few lads that weren't shooting, there. Eh? We captured him, lads. Off with his head. How many caravans are standing back there just watching me? If they all just attacked me, they'd probably just overpower me. <laughs> the final person that we're after is stashed inside. But they have a hell of a garrison and they have catapults. And I am not going near that castle while there are catapults on that wall. Hold up, the enemy run out of food and as soon as they run out of food, they've actually sallied forward and uh, come running at us. Okay, this could go in our favor or this could go badly. 
But either way, this is the battle to decide who survives. If we win, the Asurai is no more, and the Resistance own all of Kalradia. If we lose, well, the Asurai will live to see another day. We have nowhere to run. Now we fight to the death. One kingdom is coming out of this, the winner. The question is who? Is it the mighty resistance? These lads who have trained from nothing. They were just farmers. Or will it be the Asurai? I should probably move out the way before my lads shoot. Oh! Oh shit, we've been shot already, lads. We can't afford to be taken out the fight so soon. If we get killed early on, the lads will break formation and it will all go south. Now it's just 500 infantry. I don't like the fact that there's 300 range. That's what's putting me off a little bit, lads. There's 300 ranged out there. The fight to decide who gets Calradia. Oh god, reinforcements just dropped in right in front of them like that. That's a bit awkward. I'm surprised there was only one friend. Oh, two, three. No, just the two. Two. Oh, three. Three friendly fires. Oh, lads, what have you done? What have you done to the formation, men? Men, what have you done? Get back in a line and shoot! Oh, no, 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 no. They just randomly turned into a bubble. It wasn't even a box. They just bubbled. Oh, the kill feed, lads. The kill feed. What are you doing, men? Just stand still and shoot. Oh, lads. Lads, lads, lads. Stop rearranging the lines. Oh, now I'm dead. Are we winning? Have we won? Can we call this a win? Look at them run across the desert. Oh, God. Oh man, 60 dead, 100 wounded. Oh man. But we did take out 500. Well, that was almost a disaster, lads. You surprised me with that one. Didn't even form the box. They formed the bubble. <laughs> and we have captured you. The last of the Asurai Lords. Any last words? No? You're just going to be silent? Is this how it's going to be? Hmm? Oh, as if they could say anything anyway. <laughs> well, off with their head. And that is it. All of Colradia is green. We did it, lads. We did it. The resistance has conquered every corner of the world. It took a while. It took a while. We had our ups and downs, lads. Especially in the uh, early stages when we had our war with the feds non-stop. But we did it. We have conquered all of Colradia. It is done. The men can rest. All those caravans that were once enemies are now my own personal army. <laughs> Now the question is, do we start a civil war with the Resistance and try to become the leader of the Resistance? Or do we break off and start our own, the new Resistance, you know? And if we do, well, there's a lot of Resistance we'd be fighting and trying to kill. There's a lot of them, lads. Can we do it? Can we pull it off? Can me and my, uh... Oh, hang on, we've got... We don't even have a single crew out. Oh, God. We're going to have to send the lads out. Get the lads recruiting. While it's peace. 
Do we go to war with the resistance? That is the question. And if we do, how successful would that war truly be? Who knows? Who knows? But that's going to be it for now, folks. As always, if you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe. And until next time, see ya.